The other day while I was on my walk, I noticed a newspaper sitting on the sidewalk in front of someone's home. Very quickly, I grabbed my camera and took a picture and later posted it to social media and said, does anybody know what this is? I'm not quite sure. Can somebody help me? Of course, it got laughs and comments from people older than me and people much younger than me. I don't know about those of you that are watching, but I don't read the newspaper anymore. And as a matter of fact, I watch the news very little, even on regular TV. Most TV that I watch is not live. It's amazing how times have changed because I remember when the cell phone first came out. I remember when social media first hit the, uh, the social, hit the internet airwaves. I remember our first email address when we got on the internet at here at, at Community Bible Church, we were Griffin Road Baptist Church, and it was grbc at laker.net, and we were on the web. It's amazing how times have changed. But with each generation, as time changes, we have to be careful that we don't lose ourselves. We become in danger, there's a danger of us forgetting where we came from and forgetting the way things once were, how far we've come, and how much farther we still need to go. It's happening today even in churches. You've heard me mention before this thing called deconstruction. There are a lot of people that are now deconstructing their faith. Now what that means is, is they're tearing it apart to see what works and what doesn't. The problem is, is that often it's not undergirded by truth. Often it's just parts that they don't like, they discard. So we become in danger of actually losing our way if we forget where we came from. People want to rewrite history. They, want to re, uh, they don't want to revisit it. They don't want to remember it. They just want to rewrite it because some of it was really, really painful. But you know what? Those painful times have taught us so much. That's why it's really important that we always remember where we came from and that we know exactly what to do with the lessons that we've learned so that we don't repeat them and so that we grow from them without ever losing who we are. And that's what I'm going to be talking about this Sunday, May 22nd at Community Bible Church here in Dania Beach. I'm going to be talking about remembering where we came from. We're going to be looking at a story from the life of Moses and Joshua and some conversations that Moses had with the people of Israel and what he told them they needed to do so that they didn't forget where they came from. There's some great lessons in there for us as we are looking back at who we are and where we came from, what we need to keep, and what we need to discard. So if you've been in this mode of deconstruction, if sometimes you think your faith isn't working for some reason, this Sunday will be for you right here at Community Bible Church. We're going to be having our two services, one at 9.45 a.m. and one at 11 o'clock a.m. If you can't join us in person, we'd love to have you join us online at 11 o'clock a.m. Make sure that you join us on our YouTube channel. Thank you for watching. Pass this along to a friend. And this coming Sunday, we're going to look at remembering where we came from. Thank you, and we'll see you then.